such a pleasure to speak to you today. Hi. <laughs> I'm good. How are you? <laughs> Very well, thank you. Um, perhaps you could start by telling us a little bit about your character, Mary, in the series Manhunt and what it was about the script that made you kind of want to climb on board and be part of this story. At first, I was a bit fearful because it was a period piece, so that would require me playing a slave, just naturally me being a black woman. Um, but I did love how much power Mary Sims came into on her own and in her journey. So just the awareness of her past, like coming back into slavery and just like seeing how she worked through, like finding out like, you know, her fears and her, like all of this information that she's getting throughout this house, just to kind of come into herself and become like courageous enough to tell her story, which is kind of very admirable as a person who didn't get to tell their story much back then. And I think sort of like you hinted about your character, she's kind of hidden and hiding. And then she comes to the forefront in the thing that happens mm -hmm. to her. How on earth did you prepare to kind of play that? Because I can't imagine there's very much historical evidence for you to yeah. work with. So how did you portray her? So every little moment mattered. Every little moment was um, its own like exploration because there wasn't much to know about her. So me and Monica kind of found a little bit, um, I found a little bit and then Monica kind of really found the the true information of Mary Sims. So it was just knowing what little bit we did and just kind of also playing to what a black woman would feel too, because all of their stories weren't told. So just kind of coming to like an average as well to kind of tell that what it would have looked like in that time for somebody who looks like me. Obviously the production and the, the casting, I mean, it's, a, it's huge, it's epic. And it's so, so well done to sort of step into something that feels so authentic. Mm -hmm. So were there any kind of stand up moments for you or particular scenes that you really enjoyed being a part of? I really liked being a part of the scene with John Wilkes Booth while I was shaving him only because it was um, the first time for Mary Sims that the outside world came into her world. The first time she had kind of communicated with it, saw it, like maybe responded to it, like questioned it. So just all of those things that were going on in her head at that moment. I would say that was really fun to experience and to kind of act through because there was so much that I had to dive into for Mary Sims. So I was in that world in all of her reactions and to have somebody's character like John Wilkes Booth so opposite Mary, it was just nice to see that reaction, like to see that interaction. And what do you hope that viewers will take away when they watch this series? I hope they take away just like the more specifics in like that case, like what was actually going on, what it was actually about, how it actually like played out. I do think people have one idea that it was one assassin and one big thing, but it was actually so many pieces moving before, during and after that it's, it's, it's really just good. It's just some juicy stuff. <laughs> <laughs> well thank you so much for speaking to me today thank and you. good luck to all thank you very thank much you. bye you.